All right, so I have Brian here from Scalar Performance. We saw this 86 yesterday and we're just blown away. So I'm gonna have him kind of walk us around the car here, explain what's been done. I guess we'll just start with the battery. So it's a 68 kilowatt hour battery? 65, 65. yeah. Yeah, so, okay. so it did start life as a 2022 GR86. Okay. Now we're calling it the SCR1. This is the first car that you can actually go race in NASA Super Touring. Wow. So the first all-electric car that's approved for use in NASA Super Touring series across the country. We put a 65 kilowatt battery in it. It starts here in the engine bay, and it runs down the transmission tunnel of the car and into the, where the back seats and the gas tank would be. So that's how we kind of allocated the space for the, the batteries. And it was also important from a weight distribution perspective, right? Yeah. We've actually changed this car from like the front engine, rear wheel drive setup of a 5545, which would be stock. Yep to actually the reverse, it's 45 front, 55 rear weight distribution. So the same handling distribution of a mid-engine sports car. Okay. Like, like uh, my Porsche GT4 is exactly that weight nice, distribution. Nice, nice. And I think it's one of the most approachable cars to drive that I've ever driven. Yes. And that's really like kind of a design target with this. Yeah. Right? And, and um, you kept it rear wheel drive, it looks so like? So it's rear wheel drive. Yep. Up front here is like lots more cooling because cooling, as you might imagine, in race applications yeah. can be really serious. Yep. So it's chilled water cooling the battery system. Okay. Uh, chilled water also cools the inverter. Around the back here, the- Also, this video is sponsored by the Ridge Wallet. My previous wallet here, it bends and folds and over time it gets stretched out. The Ridge Wallet always feels like it did the first time and that's the beauty of the Ridge Wallet. The Ridge Wallet is compact, durable, and it won't lose its shape over time. So right now through December 22nd, you can get the best offer by clicking the link in the description up to 40% off of all the various products that Ridge carries on their website. Again, the link is in the description, ridge.com slash jeeps, ridge.com slash jeeps, jeeps can save you up to 40% off. It holds up to 12 cards. It holds its shape over time. Ridge, thank you for sponsoring the video. There's a separate cooling system for the motor and that's all oil based. Okay. So a lot of these motors would be oil to water. We've gone pure oil. It's actually better for cooling. And so that's the dry sum system. Uh, the Stealthy V motor from Hypercraft, and then the gearbox, the partner company E-Tractive okay. in, in Ontario, they designed that for us. So that gearbox, it actually houses the differential, which is a Torsen limited slip out yeah, of a GR86. Like, yeah. That way we can use the stock stub axles. And if you wanted to change to some other GR86 manufactured differential, you could very easily. And then the gear reduction is all hardened steel gears. So it's straight drive, direct drive to the differential. And they're straight cut gears, so it'll sound like the loudest dog box you ever really? heard. Really? Wow. Right? So it sound like race cars. Yeah. Right? I, I'm not much for fake sounds. Right. No, no, no. no. I, yeah, I <laughs> like, think like when Dodge came out with that sound, it's like... It's just wrong. It's an like, like <laughs> gas cars make those sounds. EVs make different sounds. That has its own uniqueness to and it. So this was our answer to like make it sound like a traditional race car without faking anything. Right. That's really cool. And, and they're stronger. So they take all the torque. Yeah. Right? So, yeah. So going all out, what would be the range on this? And then what's the max charge it can take? 150 kilowatt charging is what Input. we're targeting from a level three charge. Okay. We've done actually the same thing that we thought was so clever, but then we saw that Audi did for the Hunatron, which is a separate charge cart, oh. right? So that we take the charging infrastructure off the car. No need to carry that around every lap. Yeah. Right? That'll be on a separate charge cart, so it'll support the level two and the level three charging with that, but up to 150 kilowatt, which will recharge your car in 20 minutes. Wow. That's, that's really impressive. So, What's the horsepower? So this one right now, we're rating it at 328, oh, wow. uh, which is largely based on math right now to give us the one hour runtime. The motor's actually capable of 530. Wow. So, so well, you have a lot of space we, there. we have some space to tune it up. We can conservatively say that it'll do at least the 330. Wow. This is wow. really impressive as far as a build goes. I can't even imagine. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The, the goal is it goes from here to Atlanta Motorsport Park. Okay. Well from here to PRI, to Atlanta Motorsport Park, where we'll do like real shakedown testing. Yeah. And, and really start setting some lap times and really figuring out how to dial in the calibrations. And do you have any series where people could possibly see this perform race on the track? NASA Super Touring Series. Okay. Uh, in the 23 season, we hope to have 10 cars out in that series. Wow, that's really cool. Um, so, so we're we'll to take a look so, for them there. So we're, we're, we're doing an application through the website for first 10 buyers to buy a founder edition car. Well, we want to work with those founders directly and really get all the data and feedback from them racing their first season and put that into a production car that we can scale up the volume of. That's impressive. That's awesome. So, well, Brian, thank you for your time and showing oh, us around the you, car. Ben. This is really cool. It's nice to see the enthusiast community coming into EVs and making them fun. You know, you're not losing that. <laughs> you know, that, like, you like to tinker, you like to mess around in the garage, and this is cool that 
this is already here. So thank you. Thank you. Yeah. yeah.